Hi, in this video today we're going to see what happens when we put a PlayStation 5 game into the PlayStation 4. This is a PlayStation 4 Pro. And then afterwards we're going to see what happens when we put a PlayStation 5 game into an external drive. This is a Ultra HD Blu-ray drive, so it's a 4K drive, and plug it into the PlayStation 4. See if that does anything. Now what's interesting is, I googled this earlier, and there's articles online saying that a PlayStation 5 disc will get stuck when you put it into a PlayStation 4. But I can't see how that would happen because a disc is a disc and when you eject it it's a mechanical thing that pushes the disc out. So I'm almost certain that's not going to happen but it would be interesting if it does. So this is the game here, Spider-Man. Let's pop it in and let's see what it does. So it's come up with disc here, which it would do. It's trying to read it. Right, you can hear what's happening. It's ramping up and going down. Ramping up and going down. Right, I'll just fast forward through this bit, see if it comes up with anything eventually. Now that was interesting, it stopped and then it sounded like it was going to eject and now it's going all over again. There you go, eventually it's come up with unrecognised disc but it took a long, long time for it to do that. Right, let's see if it's going to eject. Of course it is, because a disc is a disc. Right, okay, now let's try this uh, external 4K drive here. So this is USB 3, and I'm gonna be plugging in that into there, and I'm gonna be using both USBs in the front here to give it a nice bit of power. Let's see what it comes up with now. So we've got the light on, and it's starting to spin up, and now it's stopped. And if we open it up, we'll probably see that the disc is stationary. Yeah, there you go, it's not moving at all. So uh, yeah, obviously PlayStation 5 games, as we already all guests do not work on the PlayStation 4 and even when you plug it into a drive that's capable of playing these games it's still not going to work on the PlayStation 4. So if you're wondering is there any way that you can get your PlayStation 4 to play PlayStation 5 games well, the answer is no but you can get it to display PlayStation 5 games by running it on a PlayStation 5 and using remote play on the PlayStation 4. So here we have the PlayStation 5 being displayed via remote play on the PlayStation 4 and if I was to go into Spider-Man you can see there that you can play it here. But your experience is only going to be as good as the network that you're playing on. So that is it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Take care. Bye now.